So, see in this uh, example here, show that weight of a body on the moon is one sixth that on the earth. It means if you are going to the surface of the moon, weight will reduce that will become one sixth that on the earth. So, we can solve this question is here. You can take let mass of a body be m. So, mass of the body be m, what will be its weight on the earth? So, weight is equal to we know m into g. We know it g is equal to g m upon r square. So, we can write g m into m upon r square that is actually gravitational force only. So, mass of the planet into mass of the body divided by square of the radius this is the weight. So, this ca we can take this is formula for the weight now we can write weight on the earth weight on the earth of the same body is g m e into m m e is mass of earth upon square of the radius of earth. Now, we can take similarly weight of the body on the moon. So, we can write here w m so that is on the moon g in place of mass of earth we will be taking mass of the moon into mass of the body because mass does not change whether you are on the earth or you are on the moon r m square. So, this is the weight of the body on the moon. We know it m m is equal to this is the mass of the moon we can write one hundredth of the mass of the earth and radius of the earth we a moon we can write one fourth of the radius of earth. We replace these values over here. So, we will be getting W m is equal to g 1 upon 100 of mass of earth into m 1 by 4 into radius of earth square. We can solve it here 16 g m e m upon 100 this is r e square this is weight on the moon this we can give as equation second and this we can give as equation 1. We are going to get weight on the moon. So, we can simply write w m upon w e is equal to if you divide these two you will be getting 16 g m e into m divided by 100 r e square into this here. So, here you will be writing g m e into m r e square this 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 everything will get cancelled. You will be getting w m upon w e is equal to 16 by 100 approximately we can write 1 upon 6. So, we can write w m is equal to 1 by 6 of the w e. So, you can show that weight of a body on the moon is one sixth that on the earth. Similarly, you can prove g on the moon is equal to one sixth that g on the earth. This relation also can be derived by using the same concept. So, this is about the weight change in the weight from the earth to the moon. So, now we will come to the come back to the weight again we have done unit of the weight that is only newton so weight has got another unit also so a kg weight so as we have done w is equal to mg so another important things about the weight if i write m is equal to 1 kg and g is equal to 9.8 meter per second square. So, you can write w is equal to 1 kg into 9.8 meter per second square. We can write here 9.8 kg meter per second square. This can be said equal to 1 Newton. So, we can write 9.8 Newton. 
so the weight is equal to here 9.8 newton this we can call as a 1 kg weight so we can write 1 kg weight is equal to 9.8 newton so sometimes if the weight is given to you in kg weight then you can write down this if the weight is given to you then also you can find its mass but see here for daily in, in your daily life you can use you uses mass and weight for the same purposes sometimes you say 60 kg mass 60 kg weight mostly mass is not said everybody says 60 kg weight that means when the g remains same so that 60 kg weight refers 60 kg mass so about the mass and weight these are the concepts now do one more question related to this mass and weight see in this example an object weighs 10 newton when measured on the surface of earth what would be its weight when measured on the surface of the moon it's very simple example we have done just now previous question here w m that is weight on the moon is equal to one sixth of the weight on the earth so first you calculate weight on the earth that is 10 newton already given to you so we can write here 1 by 6 into 10 that is 10 by 6 so 5 by 3 so 1.67 newton so weight is on the moon is 1 6 that on the earth that is 1.67 now how do we measure weight weight can be measured by using a spring balance in lab you use a spring balance to measure the weight and units are that is kg weight and then you can convert into newton also so now this question where you can use directly 1 6 is over here and you try to understand more question related to weight try to do questions from the book